Today we're going to show you about taking a spring out of a primary clutch, replacing it. I'll add photos. I already replaced one on a 2016 Articat Snow Pro. This is for a 2020 Polaris IQR. So I made this homemade stand just for placing your clutch on. You'll put the washer on and you'll grab a nut and we'll tighten this down to compress it and then we'll pull the bolts out. If your spring isn't broken there should be compression on the clutch and when we take the bolts out the clutch middle half here this sheave will drop away and this will come up as you slowly back the nut off this prevents it from springing open always mark your clutch there's a blue marking here with the blue marking on the bolt. And there will be a green dash here, which will follow down by another green dash. Always make sure you put them in the same spot that you're tearing them apart. Now we'll slowly back this off because the spring is still under pressure and you can tell there's a lot of tension on this bolt here as we're going up and once it starts to be more freely it'll go easier. just leave the bolts in there as is there's a mar X marked on this roller and that will follow this X on the cover and then we'll just look at this look for cracks or anything everything seems to be fine there's a little paint mixing this is spring is still good it's just a uh, race spring that Polaris uses and this will be Polaris's stock race spring it has a red line down the middle a lot of people ask if it matters if it goes up or down you can tell both sides are exactly the same so you put that back on put the cover make sure the X is matching the X and then you got to screw this down and compress it and then you can bring the bottom sheave up as well but for now we'll compress until we get tension on there and raise that middle sheave up Just start these bolts with my power wrench not a lot though just enough just to start it and then the rest 
you should do by hand once you get them started. Always go in a crisscross pattern. Now that that's down, I'll grab my ratchet, hand ratchet wrench. The, the rest you will want to do by hand. And then get them snug. And then torque them to what the specific torque recommendations are. So the torque specs is 80 foot-pounds per bolt. But always check your manual to make sure. That's what this one calls for. We torqued it to specs. Then we'll just back this wing nut back off. And as it comes off, we are now complete with changing the primary clutch spring on a 2020 Polaris 600 IQR. And then that's the final product. And that's uh, Not So Stock Shop Talk. Thank you for joining and subscribe and follow for more.